the other world. So this, I don't know, is it video 13 out of 31? And um, I guess I'm approaching half of the experiment and I thought I could start looking back a bit already. And I've seen some interesting um, developments. Uh, one is that for me the frame has changed a bit of this experiment. I started with this idea of my ability to speak is this and I need to train it to get to up here, to some ideal. And as I see it now, I have the feeling it's more like I am already able to speak and I'm just afraid to do it. So I have to practice doing it. And in a sense, it's more a matter of becoming more uninhibited and just being myself the way I am with friends. <coughs> and just speak. So it's not so much of a craft that I'm training, although it is that as well, but um, the skill that will come from speaking uh, will come almost on its own and what I should focus on or what I have been doing eventually is just getting used to speaking and and not feeling so too self-conscious about it and that I, I've seen some progress there so that's a good sign and another aspect is that it, it's ironic I mean it has been fun it has been cool seeing the the comments and I know I always take a couple of days to get back to people but for now the comments are um, reduced enough that I can actually answer to people um, so I have enjoyed that and it's ironic that the engagement has been higher than uh, all these videos that I that took me months to prepare and and, and so on and it, it's funny I guess it's a lesson right that one of the videos that have had the most impact was the one where I was not prepared and, and, and there was no almost no light and was there in the darkness talking about <laughs> the thoughts as they were arising and, and so it's interesting right like it's just like this um, cliche when you want to become a writer then you wonder ah, what, what is the pen uh, that that uh, well, Stephen King used to write I want to have that pen otherwise I cannot be a writer and and I have gone through something similar here like buying the microphone you see in the back uh, and using uh, actually before Christmas I had this idea of buying some lighting and and there is some echo in this room and I wanted to fix all these things and I'm happy that I started doing things before having something perfect I mean I, I left the first video of this channel is just a test just and it's called like that and I, I leave it on purpose I I guess it's fun to go back and see how bad it is at the beginning but then that that's the experience that it's not really about that kind of stuff and that's interesting one tries to improve the form but maybe it's really just a distraction and so I'm I'm happy to be doing this exercise and uh, I'm aware that I cannot do this forever like every day and I think the attention span I, I think it would also be too much I, I cannot imagine any one of you like really tuning in every day for forever um, but I'm thinking on the other hand I might just do another season in a while or something like that I mean it's it's still too early to say it's uh, day 13 or something um, but as I've been looking back it's it's fun and uh, I'm happy that it has a limit that it's 31 days and that's it and then I will be able to uh, maybe make, make a, a compilation of the best moments or something like that but um, 
Yeah, well, I, I, I'm happy that I already inspired Adrian to do the same and I am happy to follow him. But I also hope that these, that other people might start doing this because it's cool. It really helps you get over something, uh, some, some fears and, and so on. I wonder whether there is a, because more and more people are um, doing this, right? There are so many channels on YouTube and I wonder whether, what the limit is, right? If everyone is doing it, we cannot follow each other, right? So I wonder what, if there is a way to kind of live all together harmoniously, sharing a bit of our life or something, because it's really cool, I have to say, to get, um, to be able to share a problem and to get expert advice on things. <laughs> that's, that's for sure. Uh, and I, I've had this image of, it, it would be cool to live life having like 100 expert, 100 experts following you and you get up and then there is a physiotherapist telling you, oh, you could improve your posture here. And then there is the psychologist who says, try to do this mindfulness exercise. I don't know. Something like that it would be super cool to have a hundred experts on different subjects, just telling you, like giving you interventions when something is going wrong, like, hey, this you could, you could improve this. And in a sense, that's how I feel that this channel could be. I could just talk about the problem. And then if someone knows about it uh, and, and uh, is an expert in that field, you could just leave a short, quick comment. and. I don't know, it's, it's an interesting thought, I don't know, I also don't want to abuse of anyone's generosity, I'm just thinking that it, can, it could be fun, um, a, a fun um, utility of YouTube, if everyone was sharing a kind of their life, but also kind of the problems, and, and everyone has an, an expertise, and and just talked about that. Like, ah, you could fix this and I'm a coach. And, oh, you could fix this and, uh, and I don't know, just some ideas. And I went over seven minutes again. <laughs> anyway, that's how it went. So I'm going to stop now. See you tomorrow.